Hey guys, welcome to the Jambi Way. So today I will be budgeting my fourth paycheck in May. Before I go ahead and get started, I wanted to tell you guys something. I actually have already recorded this video, filmed it, thought it was going to be great. And then towards the end or at the end comes to realize I never even hit the record button. So that is a bit of a bummer as I wanted to take you guys along and like writing out my strips of how much I'm putting in and stuff. And of course that's not going to happen as I already did it thinking that I was recording. So yes, it's a little frustrating, but what can we do? So moving on. Um, uh, today we will be stuffing $315 into our sinking funds. So gas will get $20. Groceries and household will get $50. Cars will get $40. Medical, $50. Kids, $50. Christmas, $25. Vacation, $10. Emergency, $35. And spending will get nothing this week. So that gives me a total of $280, leaving me with $35 to put into my savings account. So let's go ahead and push that off to the side so we can start sinking. Or so we can start stuffing, sorry. Alrighty, so let me go ahead and separate the money, so my fives. My tens, my twenties, and my fifties. Alrighty, so in gas, we have 20, and we're gonna add 20 more. So now that gives me 40. I did use $20 in gas already. I did do a little bit more driving than was ex than what was expected, but that is okay. So there goes gas and groceries. Oh, my penny just fell. Let me get that. Alrighty, so I had a penny left over. I had spent $31.99 at Walmart, leaving me with $67.01. And today I am adding $50. So 20, 40, 50. Let's go ahead and count 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 91, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So now I have 117. Cars, we were going to be putting in 40. So 20, 20, 40, 60, 81, 120, and I have 120. And medical will be getting 50. So 1, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 50, 60. So medical should now have 260. Yep. And kids will be getting $50 this week. So I added the 50 and it should be 300, so 50, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 295, and 300.
And then Christmas will be getting 25. So I added 25 and I should have 250. So 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 240, 245, 250. Into Christmas. And vacation. $10. This is obviously not a big priority for me, but so 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. $80. Once it gets closer to the time where we can actually go on a vacation, then I will start stuffing more into it. So then emergency will be getting 35. So 20, 30, 35. Ready? And I added 35, so I should have 275. So 51, 20, 40, 60, 80, 2, 20, 40, 60, 70, 75. 275. And that one was into our emergency fund. And spending got nothing, of course, but I did have some change. Let me get that out. And so I went ahead and used, I had $88. I went ahead and used $20.33 at Walmart. And it left me with $67.67. But I put the $67 cents over here. And then I did give $7 to my mom. I have actually been looking for this game called Trouble, and I've gone, well, I've looked everywhere that I've gone to, and everybody's been sold out of it, so I kind of just stopped looking, and my mom went ahead and found it when she was doing groceries one day. She found it and bought it for me. So I went ahead and gave her the $7 back. So it should leave me with $60 now, 20, 40, 50, 60. Alrighty, let me go ahead and put that back into my spinning. And then for savings, my savings is an online account, um, but I did wanna keep track with it with you guys so you guys could just see how I'm doing. And I've gone ahead and put in um, my previous pay periods, how much I've put in. And for this one, we did 35. So now I'm at 145 in that one. And let me go ahead and move these all back. Oh, and for my change, I did not get like a change jar or anything for it, but one of my nieces, this is changed from last, from last time, but one of my nieces went ahead and painted this pineapple for me for Mother's Day, and I thought it was really, really cute, and it doesn't have a lid or anything, but it's just a little bit of change here and there that I'm going to be putting in it. So I decided to like keep this at my desk and just put the change in here from all of my cash envelopes. We do have another like change jar, but that kind of everybody in the family just puts change in there. So I wanted to have something separate and I thought this was really, really cute. So I'll just keep putting it in there. And that is all for today's video. I do hope that you guys enjoyed it and if you have any comments please please leave them down below and I hope everybody is still staying safe and well 
and healthy. Until next time, I'll see you guys next week. Bye!